Okay. Hello guys. Um, welcome back to class. Today we are going to review verbs and verb tenses um, for your quiz tomorrow. Uh, so we're going to just kind of review what verb tenses are, past, present, and future. Um, and then we'll play this fun kahoot. And then there's a short worksheet. And then I'll let you guys go for the day. Um, so you can tell me what a past verb is. Past tense verb. Does anyone remember? Or no? That has like ED at the end? Yeah, yep. So past tense verb um, is used to describe things that have already happened. So like yesterday, last week, um, ED, um, those kinds of things. Uh, how about present tense verbs? happening right now. Yeah, you're right. They um, are used to describe something that is happening right now or that are continuous. Um, and then past tense. Wait, future tense. Future tense verbs. <laughs> yep. And there um, is things that will happen yes. in the future. You're right. So things like later, tomorrow, next week, next year, three years from now. Um, so, do you guys have any questions about that before we start reviewing? Nope? Alright. So, um, if you guys can pull out your computers, um, go to, you guys can just Google Kahoot. Um, and then, it should just be like the first top link in Google. Arvidsson walks to school. So what is walks? Walks is present. Mr. McKean will sing a song at Friday Flag. What is will sing? Will sing is future. <laughs> So remember that will, if you see the word will, that's an automatic sign that it's probably going to be future. Good job, Emily. <laughs> Carmen and Camille baked a cake for the class. Baked. Baked is past. Good job, guys. Will throws a football at recess. Throws is the... Oh my. <laughs> that was fast. Good job, guys. <laughs> the new guinea pig will arrive tomorrow. I don't understand. Okay. What are you what do you know what are you not understanding? Why is this not past? Um, because, it, so the new guinea pig will arrive tomorrow, so this will is stating that 
the verb arrive will happen tomorrow. Uh, okay. Does okay. that make sense? Kind yeah. Of? Yeah. Okay. Thank you for asking questions. Good job, Emily. They will ask questions. <laughs> Good job. We'll ask is future. The children run on the track. Run is present. <coughs> the family moved near the school. Moved is past tense. <coughs> Trevor the tortoise slept on his rock. Slept is past. Brooke called her mom with good news. Good job. And everyone else. <laughs> My buddy colors his reindeer. This is a weird sentence. Good. Colors is present. Mrs. Arvidson's class made an ornament for their families. Made is past. Does that make sense for everyone? The children knew all of the answers. Good, new is past. I think you guys are gonna ace this quiz tomorrow. <laughs> the third graders will enjoy their winter break. Will enjoy. Good job, future tense. We walked to school. <laughs> is that an answer? Um, <laughs> no. Walk, <laughs> walked as <is> fast. <laughs> Cooked, or we cook dinner. Cook. <coughs> the cook is present. They wash their clothes. The wash is present. She will build a campfire. Good. Will build is future. Ben and Tom jumped into the pool. <coughs> jumped is past. I skipped problem nine on my math homework. I skip problem nine on my math homework. Sorry. Sorry, I read that wrong. We'll just skip that one. My bad. Sarah baked a cake for her mom's birthday. Uh, baked is past. Julie will study for the test. Will study is future tense. They dressed the dog in a sweater. The dress is past tense. All right, last one. They will watch a movie on Friday night.
Good job. Future. All right, good job, Amanda. You get an extra bonus point tomorrow on the quiz. Way to go. Um, and then the last thing I have for you guys, um, we're going to do this worksheet. Um, I went ahead and you just pass those down, actually. Sorry. There you go. <laughs> um, I went ahead and starred the three that I want you guys to do. Um, so how this is going to work is you are going to um, circle the verb in the sentences, in like the groups of the sentences. Um, and then next to each sentence, you're going to write whether it's present, future, or past tense. I'll give you a couple minutes to work on that. 